that's a good one. That is a big fish. Another stud. What's going on everyone? In today's video, I initially went out with the goal to try and see if I could find some triple tail on crab trap buoys while it was flat offshore. After running around traps for about an hour and a half and not seeing a single fish, I decided to set up on a near shore artificial reef to see if I could drop down some shrimp for some mangrove snapper. So after running around for about an hour and a half, not seeing any triple tail, I'm pulled up on this, uh, on this reef right here. How deep are we? 25 feet of water, some good structure underneath me, and I've already pulled up a couple good sized mangrove snapper and a sheep's head. I haven't had anything in the box yet, but so I throw the GoPro on and show you how I'm doing it. Got a size one hook right here, and just hooking him back by the tail like that. Big old select size live shrimp, and just a split shot above. I'm just letting it slowly drift down using 25 pound fluoro leader, like I said, on this wreck. Uh, Pen Battle 3, 2500, 10 pound braid on here on my St. Croix Avid Inshore 7 foot light action rod. And pretty consistent right now with these mangrove snapper. Wasn't really expecting this. Just dropping it down to the bottom. It takes a while with just one little split shot on there. And already getting bit. Already got something. Oh, it came off. That was a better fish. It's pretty consistent right now. Come back here by the tail. Yeah, I'm not joking. The first mangrove I missed was at least 18 inches and he popped off right next to the boat. Got the net ready now. Let's see if we can get at least a couple keepers. There's one, that's a good one. That's a good one. That's a real good one. Come on. Loosen up on him a little bit. That's a good fish. We're working with nice size mangrove. Come on up here. There we go. That's a nice mangrove right there. As soon as I start recording, I'm getting them in the boat now. Yeah, this is a nice mangrove snapper bite we got going on right now. I'm only about four miles offshore on this reef and they are munching these right now. That is a solid mangrove. Let's get the measurement on them. That is a 15 and a half inch mangrove snapper, but that's real thick. He's going in the box. Not bad when the first one you get on camera is a 15, 15 incher, but the one I missed before was easily bigger than that. Let's see if we can get a couple snapper here. Just dropping it right down here. The, the structure is all underneath the boat. And that's actually like the back edge of the structure where I'm drifting this bait over. So they're kind of sitting on that back end, it seems like. There's a split shot dropping down the shrimp. Like the easiest rig you could think of. Getting hit again. That's a better fish. That's another one. That's another good one. Something good. Come on up. Another nice mangrove. Another good one. That's what we're looking for. Another one about 15, 16 inches, I'd say. Like these are healthy, healthy mangroves. Like that's a nice mangrove right there. Let's get the measurement on them. It's another 15 and a half. Same size as the other one. One of the best eating fish that you can catch. He's going in the box too. Dang it. Definitely getting bit. That's another good one. That's another good one. Come on. Come on. This feels even bigger than the other ones. Another nice snapper. Oh yeah. Another 
That's the biggest one so far. That is definitely the biggest one so far. I am on the snapper right now and I am not complaining. Mangrove snapper is one of my favorite fish to eat. So I will take advantage of it when I can find them eating like this. All right, let's get a measurement on this beast. I'm safely saying this is the biggest one so far today. Right there. Oh yeah, he's 17 and a half. That's a good fish. He's going in the box. All right, so I got three good sized snapper in the box right now. I'm allowed five per person. So I can get two more big snapper in the box. See if they're still down there. Getting bit. Oh, I came off. Go give me a 20 incher. Oh, that was a good fish. Dang it. Little snapper. Probably keep her size, but I'm gonna hold off because I know there's bigger ones down there. I'm trying to close out my limit on some bigger ones. Mangrove snapper only need to be 10 inches to keep. So he, he's probably right around there, probably like 11. But I'm gonna let him go. See you, dude. Woo, jumped. Not chumming or anything, not doing any of the strategies that should really get them fired up, but they're just here. They're hot and heavy right now. They're liking the shrimp. That's a good one. That's a good one. Nah, not that big. I'm gonna hold off on keeping this guy too. This guy's probably like 12, 13 inches. I could keep her snapper, but I wanna wait for the bigger ones. See you, dude. Save the shrimp too. Yep, that felt like a good bite. Yep, that's a good one. That's another good one. Come on over here. Oh yeah, that's another good one. Uh, He's like borderline. Yeah, I'll probably keep him. Oh yeah, that's a sud, actually. Let's get a measurement of I'm saying 15 inches. Right there. Yep, 15 inches. I'll keep that guy too. This is turning out to be a great mangrove snapper bite right now. Come on. There we go. That's a good one. That's another good. That's a good one. That's a good one. That's a good one. That's a good one. Come on. This one's another stud. Another stud. And that's my limit right there. That is so sick. I've been at this spot for about 45 minutes and I've easily caught my limit of nice size mangrove snapper. Like these are all solid fish. Let's get a measurement on them. Probably going 16. Right there. Right at 16. Nice fish. Throwing him in the box and he's the last one I can keep. All right, now I'm just fishing for fun. How many shrimp I got left? Got four shrimp left. Let's save one just in case for a triple tail on the way back, but. See if I can get one more stud just for fun. Simplest rig you could think of. Just a couple split shots, a live shrimp dropping it down on a wreck, and it is producing today. Last shrimp dropping it down. So for a big one.
And that's a big one. That is a big fish. Yeah, no. Uh, that felt like a grouper. It just wrecked me in there. Huh. All right. Well, that was fun. <laughs>